Okay, so this little guy, unfortunately, I'm going to have to do this in two videos. I accidentally stopped the other one instead of pausing it. This little guy here is Winter, and he is a blue lynx point, of course, a male. In Callista's litter, we had three males that were all lynx point Balinese kittens. He's very sweet. He'll come, come get up in my lap. He'll play. They're all starting to purr. One second. Now it's just you, little guy. So I know some people are waiting for blue lynx points. This is a beautiful kitten. You can see how beautiful he is. He has nice dark eyes so far. Of course, eyes, he just probably got knocked in the eye when we were swinging things around. But eye color does lighten with age. So usually by the time the kittens are about 10 weeks old, their eye color is set. But this is... This is Winter, our blue Lynx Point Balinese. I'm gonna get another kitten out now. And this kitten is Frost. He is our Lynx Point Balinese, Lilac Lynx Point Balinese. And you can definitely see a difference in the facial structure between Frost and Snow. They are both Lilac Lynx Points. They both have great personalities. Neither one of them are scared or skittish or mean. They're just very, very sweet. But you can definitely see a difference in the facial structure of the cat. So I'm going to try to focus in on that. Frost is a lot like his brother Winter in the facial size. See those beautiful whisker pads? They're so pretty. I like a little plump nose. I think that's so cute. But anyways, all the cats are very playful. They're all very similar in personality. They're very precocious. They run all around. They climb on me. They cry. They meow. They play. You like that? Hmm? Yes, I know. This one's dying. This one, the feathers have been taken off. I'm, I was so sad when True Value went out of business because they you could find these feather sticks there and they're so great. Yes. Wait, I'm gonna get another kitten out. We'll get the we'll get snow out so you guys can compare the two lynx points. This is snow, so you can see how his face is a little different. His head is more round. Uh, you can always tell the difference in between the ears. The foreheads are wider. It makes for a more round head. Um, the ears are not as on top of his head. That makes his head appear more round. His eyes are really nice too. They're coming in nice. So far, still dark. I think Snow is the more independent of the group, although he's not skittish in the least bit. He's very calm. He's a calm kitten. And of course, he's a lilac lynx point as well. Snow is the one that did not have a collar on during the first uh, introduction that I made of these kittens. Whoa, okay. You can sit down. Those are the little Siamese. They're always making noise. start with the Siamese sisters now. All of the Siamese are girls. All of the Balinese that I just showed to you, they are all boys. All right. So the first Siamese kitten is Iceland. She's a real pretty baby. She has good eye color so far. I was hiding their other toy because they just go bananas over it. Let me get it. Iceland is a very precocious girl. She's very friendly. She's calm. She meows a lot. She has a really nice head shape. 
Her ears are nicely set on the side of her head, not the top. She is a perfect little traditional lilac point Siamese kitten. She will be short haired. Siamese kitten, the Siamese. The next kitten is Crystal. She is pretty. She has a really nice head. She likes that toy over there. She always goes right for it, that chew toy. Yes, Crystal. Crystal is a lilac point Siamese. Look at that nice round head. And she will be short hair as well. Hi, baby. So far, all the kittens have nice colored eyes. I'm not worried about pale blue eyes. And really, that's not it. It doesn't affect their health. It's just what some breeders prefer, dark eyes. Some pre don't really care. I always try to get the best of the best. And I feel that dark eyes are the best of the best. So <laughs> it doesn't have to be dark. But hi, pretty girl. You're so pretty. You're such a pretty baby. You're quiet out here. You don't want to talk? You're looking for your brothers and your sisters? Yeah, are you looking for them? Where'd they go? They're nursing on Mama right now. Do you like this one? One thing I will tell you about this litter is that they will rip their toys up. I've noticed the little balls, like that orange ball there, if you don't watch it, they're torn up. So please, when you bring your babies home, keep that in mind. This group, I don't know what it is, but they are feisty. You guys are so feisty, Crystal. You are. You, since birth, they have been feisty. Must be a Calista thing, because she can be feisty. All right, let's do your last sister, okay? The last baby is Diamond. Hi, Diamond. You're so cute. You're a good girl, too. You look just like everybody else. You're all so pretty. You are. You all are so pretty. I know. What are you going to do? You want a toy? You want this toy? There you go. So Diamond is the last Siamese female sister. Well, this female sister. And she will be a lilac point, no links, Siamese short hair. And she's a sweetheart. They're all really similar. time for me to get these kittens to the vet for their checkups so that's coming up uh, and then we just keep on uh, working on playing boundaries learning manners make sure they can be started on wet food before they leave um, gosh it goes so fast are you caught are you caught there you go you did it you did a good job all right now we're going to let all of them out a lot of chaos is about to ensue. Get up. Hi, babies. Come on. Let's play. Let's play. There you are.
they were nursing and now they're sleepy. Hey, right, Mama, you're doing a good job. You are. You're doing a real good job. Honestly, mom's gonna mom's going a little bananas with the toys. You guys don't like those paper collars, do you? We've reverted to paper collars and we've gotten rid of the rubber bands just because they're very risky. Our cats like to eat the rubber bands, so we've gotten rid of those. And of course these collars are itchy. Mama's hogging all the toys. She's got one in her mouth, one in her paw. She says, no way, I'm not letting anyone play. <laughs> Look at that, one in the mouth, one in the paw. Sorry guys, no toys for you. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video, and of course, I'll give you more updates as they grow. I'm going to go work with Lover's Kittens next. They are doing so awesome. We've given them free range of the bedroom, even at such a young age. They are so cooperative and clean, and um, Lover's doing a great job corralling them and keeping them all together. So, Okay. Have a good day, everybody.